Hey everybody, Big E from the Mid Michigan Biker Podcast. Hope you're all enjoying your weekend. Um, it's Saturday. I am getting ready to do some podcasts. OG and PP should be here sometime soon, and we have some good interviews lined up and a story or two, I'm sure. Um, I know we're planning on talking about the upcoming Wild Hogs trip. I got, uh, yeah, a couple good interviews today, too. Uh, right now, been working on the uh, YouTube channel. Be sure to go check that out um, at Mid Michigan Biker on YouTube. Um, got some gear reviews on there. There is actually the only live, ever live, um, Mid Michigan Biker podcast that we have done. We will be doing more of those. They were quite fun. Um, I want to touch base a little bit about my Scorpion Covert riding jeans. I actually picked up a second pair on eBay, dirt cheap, 50 bucks used, um, same size. You can tell they've been washed. They're a little faded. So that brings me a little faith to the pair that I bought that are like the dark, dark blue will actually fade out and look somewhat normal. Um, so that's good. Um, but I did notice that these shrunk a little bit. So I'm gonna have to be careful about drying them probably the first few times I wash them. Uh, they are very comfortable. I rode them for about 150 miles on a Sunday in probably mid fifties weather. Um, no need for chaps, that was for sure. They blocked the wind quite nice. I bought the Scorpion Covert Flexible Armor for the knees and hips and didn't really know it was there. So that's good. I had read some reviews on them that the armor, because it's flexible, bunched up in the bottom of the pocket. I did not experience that. I don't know if it's because the armor is still new, um, but I will keep an eye on it and I think I have a fix for it if it does happen. So, and if that is the case, I will fix it and let you all know how it works. Um, I'm looking forward to some riding with them soon. I'm sure I'll be sporting them for the Blessing of the Bikes in Baldwin. Um, that will be a good test that weekend because you never know what the weather's going to be like. It might be 100 degrees. It might be 40 degrees. So that'll be, that'll be a good review weekend for them. And again, the uh, Wild Hogs trip, I'm sure they'll see use on that. Um, the YouTube channel is coming along, growing a little bit. So that's good. Hopefully you guys are enjoying some of the reviews. If you are, give them a like. Um, be sure to be subscribing, tell your friends, it helps. Um, we want to be able to share these reviews with everyone. Um, like I said, we're getting ready to do some podcasting this afternoon. We're going to be doing uh, one of our podcasts with um, traditional American cycle supply. And we have some exciting news to tell you and share with you about them and us and a little something we're working on. So be sure to look for that episode um, coming up next couple weeks. Be sure you're subscribing to us on whatever platform you're listening and streaming your podcast from. Um, please give us a review, give us a like. I know you can do that stuff on Spotify. Um, not an Apple guy, so I don't know about that. Um, be sure to look for us on Facebook, follow us, like us, whatever it is you have to do there. Um, as soon as we hit a hundred subscribers, which is, we're a third of the way there folks. So I know it wouldn't take much more and then somebody's going to get a pretty cool prize because we're going to put together a little prize package. The closer we get to a hundred subscribers and uh, we'll be giving something away. Pretty excited about that. So, that's all I got, bikers. Um, life is short. Get after it. We're out of here.